Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Cube 4 of the Weekly Contest 305, longest ideal subsequence. I made another uh, error on this one, but hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's problem or this problem. So this one, I actually kind of feel a little crappy about it because I got a, I, I solved this by using uh, top down. Um, and if you looked at my Cube 3 video, I talk about this a little bit. But because I think mostly because I, I've been way recently just been way... Um, we're used to doing top down. Uh, maybe I should practice a little bit more with bottoms up. And this one is a bottoms up question, but because I do 26 times, uh, because it shouldn't be that much, but it's, it's about 2.6, you know, it's 10 to the fifth times 26. And it should be okay, to be honest, if you ask me, but sometimes these are the bricks and I did not get this correct. Um, yeah, in terms of space. Um, and instead, I took another three minutes. I have to rewrite it. And as you can see, if I minus three minutes, if I minus the five minute penalty, I would have been like about, you know, 13, 14 minutes, which is people are really fast this contest, but it still would have been a very respectable finish. Uh, but instead, it's going to be an out, you know, it's going to be an ouch. The way that I just, so if you look at this, this is basically the idea that I had, which is, yeah. Um, otherwise, Otherwise, I just wrote it in a bottoms up kind of way, and this is the one that I actually AC'd. Um, basically, I go, okay, we start with, uh, you know, uh, uh, a subsequence of zero, and then here, the best sub i is just, we and we updated, I did it in place, so you don't have to, but best sub i is you go to the, um, the longest subsequence that ends in this character, right? And that means that if, yeah, um, and that's pretty much it, really. Um, and then we, we do a for loop, and then we, and I kind of, you could do this in a much slicker way, but I did it because I was just lazy, is that for every other character, we go, okay, is it less than K different distances away? And also that this is not, you go to the same number, because otherwise, um, you don't need this condition if you use like a previous array, best array thing, but you can also prove that you only need one array, but this was only 26 elements, so maybe I shouldn't have spent time optimizing that. But in any case, yeah. Um, if this was within K, then we, we look at the best, you know, this is the best, um, the longest subsequence that ended on a previous character, and then you extend it by adding it to this character, right? So that's basically what this is saying. And yeah, this is going to be linear time times alpha, where alpha is the size of the alphabet. So it's going to be O of alpha times n time, and space is just going to be O of alpha space, as you can see. Um, yeah, and this one's relatively quickly. Um, and yeah, I feel a little dumb for doing it the long way, because um, even a five-minute finish would have been, was five, six minutes, I would have been, you know, like maybe not top 25, but pretty respectable. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you think. This is, uh, and I think if this, um, I think my explanation, this one is a, a little bit short. And if you feel that it's a little bit short, I apologize. Ask questions in the comments or come to the Discord and ask. But I would also say that there are a lot, a lot, a lot of lead code problems that um, that are similar. And I think it's even today's daily problem is very similar. So definitely check that out. And once you kind of get these, um, what they call digit DP, uh, I think, um, but basically like a, a sub character DP or something like this, um, then you should be able to get this one quickly, even if I'm hypocritical because I didn't get it quickly. But eh. anyway, um, you can see how I made this mistake in the live contest portion now. Well, people are already done.
this is one where I'm trying to figure out if this is going to be too slow in Python. And let's just see, maybe it'll be too slow in Python. But Hmm, why did I get six? What am I missing? If I skip. Why is. I mean, this is fine, but do I miss too much? Let's 
a little bit slower than I would like. I should be fixing this already. So the two and three is not good. Then why am I? Why is my logic wrong here? It's because of this, maybe. I'd start a new string. Maybe this is not the right one. Maybe I made time out. That's the only thing. Python issues. Maybe I should have time with dynamic programming. Bottoms up. Yeah, it's going to time out. Or memory limited. This is silly. I mean, people have already done with this because this is pretty straightforward. Wow, there's a lot of people that finished it. <sighs> wow, that's actually a lot of people that was. Hmm. Uh, yeah, okay, fine. Six and seven. That's not good. Oh, it's because it's. This time's out too, I'm gonna to be really sad. Okay, should have done it that way then, I guess. Thanks for watching, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about these poems, and I'll see you later. Bye bye.